Hello, I'm Kohiro, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get these fireworks. Now, you may think these aren't so special, they're just fireworks. But first of all, you can see they've got a pretty long name. You can't actually see the name off in the corner. So what's special about these then? We put them down and look. They are every single colour of firework. What I'm going to be showing you today is the website you can use to get these fireworks. Now, can I... So first, they don't have to be every colour. On the website, you customise your firework. You customise how far up they go. Um, the colour, the way they explode. And yeah, so, let's see this video. I mean, the website. Another thing is... You can get this firework from, in the description of this video, I'm going to put how you, get, how you can get this using just a single command block. What you're going to have to do for that is get yourself a command block, or do the slash give command I showed in my previous episode. Put it down, go into it, and do control V, and with that command, you can put in here, you press the button, and it should give you fireworks. So yeah, that's, that's that. But now to the website. So you're going to want to come on to the place where you search things. Go on to Google. And what you're going to want to do is come in here and search Minecraft.tools. Okay. This will bring up the first link here. Click the first link. And what this is going to bring you to is this website. Now on the left, you can see all the options that you can get. I will show you how to get this stuff in other videos. But you want to click on this firework crafting. Now when you're here, this is where you pick your customizable firework. You can pick all the colours. If you want your firework just to be blue or cyan, you can pick that. If you want it just to be red, pick that. You want your file to be yellow, green, and blue, you pick all those. So pick the ones you want your file to be. So if you want the multicolored one, you're gonna have to click every single one of them. Like this. And then you're gonna want to click this one. This is what the colours will be when you when it fades out after it's exploded. So you're gonna wanna come and click all of these. Like that. Then pick what you want it to look like when it actually explodes because that's a pretty important part of a firework. So you can pick this one, this one, the star, the big one, or the small one. I'm going to pick the big one because bigger is better. And then here I'm going to pick this one which looks like a real life one. I don't really know what this one is. So I'm going to pick this one. Then this is the height your firework will go up to. If you pick this one, it's going to... You're going to put down your firework, it's going to go up a few blocks and explode, like that much. This one, it explodes like twice the height, and this one's like three times. So click this one, then you're going to want to press validate. Now this is going to bring up this long command here. If you think this is complicated, um, it's really not. All you've got to do is just hover over all this bit. This bit is if you want to summon it right where you are. So what you're going to do is hold this. Press Control C, or press this button which copies it to your clipboard again. Then you're going to want to go back into Minecraft, put it in a command block. So yeah, you want to come in here again. And with that command you just got, you, you'll realise if you do Control V, it, it just comes up red. It's because you can't actually do it in your typing thing, because there's a limit of what you can type. So because it, it's a big command, it can't fit all in. So what you're going to have to do is get your command block. You can do the slash, slash give your name, command block, then press that to give yourself one. You put it down, and then you do control V, and there's, there's your command. Now, click on the very edge side, or just use the arrow buttons to go back and forth. It's just S, change it to at P. And then just press done, 
and get yourself a little button or some source of power. And there you go. There it is. That's the firewall you just made. If you want to just red, you go back on the website. Instead of clicking all the colours, just press the the red one. And yeah, that's how you get these fireworks. If you want to stack with them, just click on it with whatever you place with. The button that you place with. Then middle click on it. And then you get a stack. If you want to put all out your infantry, you hold middle click and drag it along. Then let go of middle click. There you go, all of them. You see work in survival as well. So yeah, that's how you get command. That's how you get really good fireworks using that website. Thanks for watching. Bye.